What is up guys? It is Joe here from Joe Talks Wrestling and I am here today with my beautiful girlfriend Ellie. We have seen her on the channel before. Say hi. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> um, and today we are doing WWE Elimination Chamber 2023 predictions video. The premium live event is this Saturday. This video is being filmed before the Go Home Smackdown but after the Go Home Raw. So as usual, if there's any matches updated uh, to the card, I will add them in the description and the comments alongside mine and Ellie's prediction for the show. Without further ado, ladies and gentlemen, let's get right into prediction number one. Coming in with prediction number one, the match is the Grit Couple versus the Judgment Day, Edge and Beth Phoenix versus Finn Balor and Rhea Ripley. But before we get into that, a quick disclaimer. Ellie, how much do you know about wrestling? Nothing. Literally nothing. So, you know, if please forgive Ellie if she comes out with some really <laughs> dumb, wild predictions <laughs> because you have no idea what's going on on Raw and SmackDown. In fairness, I don't really have any idea what's going on in Raw and SmackDown anymore. So, we're just winging it. Uh, I'm literally showing Ellie a picture of who the wrestlers are, and you're basing your prediction off of that, aren't you? So, my prediction for this match is for Edge and Beth Phoenix to lose. I have got something at WrestleMania, Edge and Finn Balor, or something like that is going to happen, I'm pretty sure. Uh, so, I feel like Edge and Beth Phoenix are going to get uh, one-upped once again by the Judgment Day, and I feel like Rhea Ripley in particular needs a massive victory going into Elimination Chamber, considering she has just won the Women's Royal Rumble. Ellie, who are you predicting to win this match? Edge and Beth Phoenix, or Finn Balor and Rhea Ripley? Edge and Beth Phoenix. Any reason why? Because I like Edge. <laughs> <laughs> is, is that it? The whole reason? Okay. Edge and Beth Phoenix for Ellie. Rhea Ripley and Finn Balor for me. So already we're head to head. We'll see who uh, we'll see who wins after the show is over. On to the next prediction. Prediction number two on the Elimination Chamber card is the women's number one contenders Elimination Chamber match. The winner of this will face Bianca Belair at WrestleMania for the Royal Women's Championship. In this match, we have Carmella, Nikki Cross, Raquel Rodriguez, Asuka, Liv Morgan and Natalia. Who do you think's going to win, Ellie? Asuka. Asuka. <laughs> okay, was that completely random? <laughs> yeah. Any reason? She just looks cool. She looks cool. Mm. Okay, fair enough. I am going with Asuka as well. She just returned in the Rumble with a new look. I'm really, really excited to see uh, Asuka, this version of Asuka, taking on Bianca Belair. And I definitely think that she should win the Elimination Chamber. Prediction number three for Elimination Chamber. We got big meaty men slapping meat. We have <laughs> Brock Lesnar versus Bobby Lashley again. Now this has happened, I think, two or three times. I think they're at a tiebreaker. They're pretty even. So, Ellie, I'm going to ask you first. Who do you think is going to win, Brock Lesnar or Bobby Lashley? Well, I wanted Bobby Lashley to win because... Uh... <laughs> You're not a massive Lesnar fan, are you? No, but then Bobby Lashley took the belt from Drew McIntyre and I like Drew McIntyre, so I want Brock Lesnar to win. Oh, okay. Okay, that for a spanner in the work. So Ellie and I have watched a little bit of wrestling here and there. Um, more late, la uh, no, early last year, sorry. We, we had a little look at things, some older stuff from when I grew up. I definitely showed you Undertaker losing the streak to Brock, so... You weren't really a massive Brock fan then. No. Um, but, okay, you're choosing Brock Lesnar now. Yeah. That's interesting. Um, I'm going to go with Bobby to win. Uh, I think this could go either way once again. But, uh, I don't know. Do you know what? I'm only picking Bobby because you picked Brock. And uh, I, I think you and I need to go head-to-head -head on a couple of these predictions. So, Ellie is going with Bobby Lashley. No. Oh. I was just making sure you're paying attention. <laughs> Ellie's going with Brock Lesnar. I am going with Bobby Lashley. Next up is the second, the final Elimination Chamber match of the show. Austin Theory defends his United States Championship against Montez Ford, Johnny Gargano, Bronson Reed. That's Austin Theory there with the championship. I have to show Ellie the photos. Seth Freakin' Rollins and Damian Priest. Who do you think is going to win? If you just look at these photos right here, who do you think? 
is going to walk away with the United States Championship. I'm going to say Seth Rollins because he's the only one I've heard of. Okay, fair enough. You're going with Seth freaking Rollins. Nice yeah. to know. I am very, very torn in this match because Seth currently doesn't really have any direction for WrestleMania. Um, so I feel like he could win the United States Championship and then obviously have a US Open Challenge or ladder match or something like that. Um, but I also quite like the idea of having maybe Austin Theory hold an open challenge at WrestleMania and have like John Cena answer it because they've been building to a little feud and, you know, Cena could win the title for one night, whatever, defend it and lose it the next night on Raw against someone. Uh, but that's just me fantasy booking. If you're going with Seth freaking Rollins, normally I don't bet against my favourite wrestler, but I am actually going to predict for... Austin Theory to retain the United States Championship here and go on to defend the title at WrestleMania. So, just to be clear, Ellie, who are you predicting? Seth. Seth who? Seth Rollins. It's Seth freaking Rollins, <laughs> Ellie. God. <laughs> Seth freaking Rollins uh, for Ellie and Austin Theory for me. And that brings us to the main event of the evening. Montreal is the place Elimination Chamber is taking place. And their hometown boy, Sami Zayn, is challenging the Tribal Chief, Roman Reigns, for the undisputed WWE Universal Championship. Ellie, you don't really... Uh, well, you're not really familiar with what's gone on with Sami and the Bloodline, are you? No. So if I give you a brief rundown. Sammy joined the Bloodline, Roman's group. He was basically family. And then at the Royal Rumble, after taking some verbal and a little bit of physical abuse from Roman, Sammy snapped and hit Roman with a chair. Therefore, the Bloodline is basically in pieces right now, and Sammy is challenging Roman for the title. Sammy is over AF with the crowd. They love him. They want to see him win. Do you think that Sami Zayn can beat the Tribal Chief, the man who has been undefeated for basically 900 days? I don't think so. So who are you predicting? To win. Mm -hmm. Roman. Oh, okay. You're going with Roman Reigns. Yeah, because he's beat like everybody else. And I don't think he'll let him drop it to Sami Zayn. So you don't care about how much the crowd love him? You're evil, you are. You're evil. Poor Sami Zayn, but... Unfortunately for you guys, I am evil also. Roman Reigns is winning here. There is no way, no chance in hell that Sami Zayn, I'm sorry, I love Sami, I know he's over, but you're not going to have Sami end the 900-day undefeated, unstoppable run of the tribal chief Roman Reigns. It's just not going to happen. I think there will be some interference to protect Sami here. Uh, you can have Jey Uso come out. And, uh, you know, Jey Uso has been very conflicted. He's a big Sammy fan. He loves Sammy, but he's also bloodline. So he's on the fence. Uh, I think he's going to turn on Sammy once again. And uh, super kick Sammy in the middle of the ring. Drop him down. Roman pin him. One, two, three. That's just my prediction. Uh, but it is 100% going to be Roman Reigns versus Cody Rhodes at WrestleMania for the titles, in my opinion. Ellie, you agree with me? Roman winning here. There you go, guys. Elimination Chamber is this Saturday. I will be watching it. Not sure if I'll be watching it live or not yet. I'm just going to have to wait and see. But I will be bringing you my reactions nevertheless. Thank you, Ellie, for coming on and doing my predictions with me. Hopefully, we can see you in more videos in the future. Um, if you're up for that. Yeah. Yeah, definitely. would you be up for that? Yeah. Wicked. Okay, guys. I've been Joe from Joe Talks Wrestling. This has been my beautiful girlfriend, Ellie. Let me know your predictions for Chamber in the comment section down below. Like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you in the next video. Goodbye. Actually, do you want to do the goodbye? Goodbye. <laughs>